What's up everyone, in today's video I'm going to be showing you the top 11 PC tweaks for better FPS and zero delay. I know for a fact that all of you guys already have your PCs optimized, but I can rest assure you there's at least one of these 11 tweaks that you have skipped, but that might boost your performance by double. And in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can do all of this and optimize your PC for the best performance. Now the first thing that you want to do is go in your browser and type in discord.gg slash rip tweaks, click enter and your discord should open. Now the discord server what you want to do is go into the YouTube tweaks channel and click on on the download button right here click on visit site and this link should open up now what you want to do is click on the subscribe to channel button now what this will do is basically open our youtube channel and what you want to do is just subscribe then you can go back to the other page and as you can see the link is unlocked so what you want to do is just click on unlock link and here as you can see we have a lot of files now what we're looking for is the 11 pc tweaks for better fps and zero delay so what you want to do is just right click and download on this right here now what you want to do is just drag this on your desktop then right click and open with windows explorer drag this file out now here what you want to do is just double click and let's start off with the tweaks now number one what we have is the restore point now what you want to do is just double click on here and create a restore point by clicking this button here type in any name that you want for the restore point for example rip tweaks backup and now just click create now while the restore point is being created what you want to do is overlook the other settings as you can see here we have the uninstall apps that you don't need shortcut and now what you want to do here is just uninstall all the apps that you do not need on your pc for example the razor synapse app so what you want to do is just click on uninstall if you have anything else just uninstall all of the apps to save a lot of space on your pc and further improve your performance now once this is created what you want to do is just close it and let's go to the third step which is startup apps here what you want to do is just disable all of them as you can see i have them all disabled but if you have something enabled what you want to do is just click on it and click on the disable button right here next what you want to do is go double click on this now here what you want to do is just click on adjust for best performance and now in here what you want to do is just click on the smooth edges of screen fonts show window contents while dragging and then just the show thumbnails instead of icons now what you want to do here is just apply and this will guarantee you a big fps boost as you're disabling all of these useless animations in windows now the next thing that we're going to do is go into the cleanup section which is number two and just right click and run as administrator on the clean cache right here what you want to do is just click on run now while this is done what you want to do is just wait for it to fully finish and in the meantime what we could do is double click on the disk clean up here and what you can do is just select your drive i will select the drive c because that's where i have a lot of games installed now i clicked ok and while this is cleaning up we're gonna wait for the other thing to finish as you can see this cleanup is calculating a lot of the stuff and as you can see we have 25 gigabytes of disk space that we could gain by deleting stuff like Windows Update Cleanup, temporarily Windows installation files, which take a lot of space on my PC, which I wasn't really aware about. As you can see here, I have around 159 gigabytes of space free. Now if I click OK, delete the files. As you can see, we're gaining gigabytes free storage in literally seconds while this is being done. Now while this is going on, we can go for a third step, which is the performance section. Now here what you want to do is right click and run as admin on the power tweaks, run. This should apply a lot of power tweaks that are best for your pc and will boost your performance by a ton next we can go for the services now this will disable a lot of services next we can go for the ultimate power plan which basically we could run as administrator and now if we go type in power plan in the search bar what you want to do is just click on the show additional plans and select the ultimate performance right here now we can click out and next we can go for the number fourth option which is the bloat now for the bloat section what we're going to be doing is downloading a tool which basically the bloats a lot of the bloatware on your pc for windows 10 and 11 now what you want to do is just click on this button right here for the release click on download click on the get ps1 right here and now we can drag it on the desktop now let's just right click and run with powershell open and now in here we could pick out from a lot of options on the screen now number one is the default mode basically this has a lot of apps you could select the default section is basically microsoft teams spotify sticky notes etc now we can delete the default section of the apps we can manually select which apps to remove or not remove any apps now if i click n this will basically do all of these following changes and upload your windows to make sure you have the best performance possible now i'm just gonna click enter while this is happening we're gonna go over the next steps to make sure we get the best performance now going into RAM tweaks, what you want to do is just find how much RAM you have. I have 32 gigs of RAM basically in the task manager. Go to performance, 32 gigs of RAM, double click on this here, run, make sure to click yes. And that is basically all that you need to do. The next step is the disk tweaks. Now, if you have SSD hard drive, you must do this because this 
will improve load times by a ton. Now what you want to do is select what you have. I have a SSD. Now if you have a hard drive, what you want to do is just go to the hard drive section. I have a SSD, right click and run as administrator on the SSD section right here. Click on run. And that is basically about it. Now we can go for the next step, which is internet tweaks. Now here, what we want to do is just initially restart all of the internet connections basically this will quickly just turn off all of the internet connections and basically apply a ton of tweaks that will boost your internet performance in the meantime what you want to do is just double click on this right click and run as admin on the tcp optimizer in here now the thing that you want to do is just click on the file section here and click on import it's like the rip tweaks.spg click on open and what you want to do is just click on apply changes click ok and wait for all of the changes to finish now this will boost your internet performance by a ton this will lower your ping get rid of buffer bloat and all that stuff now what you want to do is just click on no for restarting as we're going to restart later and now we can continue on to the seventh step which is the input lag tweaks here what you want to do is just double click on device cleanup and here what you want to do is literally all of the devices that aren't connected to your pc as you can see here i've used a lot of these things like 200 days ago 300 days ago basically what you want to do is just devices select all and click on delete now we can close this off and go to the next step which is the cpu tweaks now here what you want to do is just right click on whatever you have i have an amd cpu if you have an intel Go to Intel, then basically just right click, run as administrator. Now, all of these tweaks are gonna apply. Now, what you wanna do here is just double click on the on par course, and this would open this page right here. What you wanna do is just double click on this, drag it on your desktop, double click again. Now, this is the CPU unparking app, which is gonna unpark your course for the best performance. Now, what you wanna do here is if you have park course, what you wanna do is just drag this slider onto 100 and click on apply. Additionally, you could just click on unpark all, and that is all that is gonna happen. Next step, what you wanna do is go to the power tweaks and right click and run as administrator here, just run this file. Then we can go to the GPU tweaks, and here what you wanna do is pick whatever GPU that you have. I have an NVIDIA GPU. Now here what we have is this NVIDIA power. What you want to do is just right click and run as administrator here. Next, this is an NVIDIA tutorial that you want to actually copy. Now what you want to do here is just go in the search bar and type in NVIDIA control panel. And what you want to do is just go into the manage 3D settings and go into the global settings and literally scroll down and copy all of these settings as shown on screen for the best performance. Next, we can go for the inspector tweaks. And what you want to do is just right click and run as administrator on NVIDIA Pro file inspector here what you want to do is just drag this rip profile and drag it onto the app click ok and here what you want to do is just apply the changes and we can just close off the application the next step is going to the msi util v3 just right click and run as administrator on here and what you want to do is just find your gpu minus nvidia geforce rtx 360 and in here what you want to do is just click on the undefined and set it to high now here what you want to do is just click on apply x and we can go to the next step now for the windows 32 priority tweak this is for the best input lag if you want to have no input lag at all you just want to right click and run as administrator on this file right here and literally that is about it and for a bonus tweak what you want to do is double click on this fully boost your performance and this really cool website called riptweets.com will pop up what you want to do is just scroll down and find the extreme option click on purchase add to cart proceed to checkout and now once you've got it what you want to do is just double click on the riptweets v4.1 as you can see this is the app that will boost your performance by at least 10 times if you have it unoptimized it has a lot of features optimization for literally everything all sorts of hardware network tweaks input lag we have overclocking in here really cool features like driver updater fps counters for showing your fps in game crossers for improved aim in game a os reinstall feature custom gaming mode feature and a massive community which you could chat with engage with a lot of people earn points to earn steam wallet money discord nitro robux or fortnite gift cards meet up with a fantastic community and in general optimize your pc for the best performance that's about it guys thank you for watching this video if you have a channel, make sure you like and subscribe and i'll see See you next video.